Let's take a couple of minutes to describe the types of connections that you can make with a hinge component in VSP. Now this first is hinge one here in my model and I've attached it to the end of this first wing section. Now because I attached it in UW, if this section moves, this hinge and its orientation is going to move with it. And we'll see what happens when we do that out here. But first, let's look at what is effectively a pin connection, and that's pure rotation without translation. So as we rotate this up, you can see that those wing sections, including the outboard section, are all rotating along with it at the prescribed angle that I give it here. Now, if we come out to the second section, let's look at hinge two. In this case, we've got translation and rotation active. Well, what if we deactivate rotation? In this case, we have our translation available to us, again, about this direction that we've set, but it will not rotate. So in this case, we're thinking more of like a slider. There's no rotation whatsoever, but you're still allowed to move axially in a certain direction. If we were to reactivate rotation, now we have something that's a bit more like a cylinder connection, in which case, regardless of what orientation it's in, it can always translate along that direction and rotate about that direction. And that is how you can set the various types of connections. Now, something to note is that because the hinge itself is connected in UW or component rotation, that hinge is going to move with whatever it's attached to. And that then is going to control everything that is attached to the hinge. So if we set the rotation to say none and just let it stay fixed in space, it would have completely different behavior. So again, if we do that, set this to zero just as a demonstration, and then we come to motion and set this to zero again. Watch what happens now. If I come to hinge one and try and fold this up again, notice what happens. Because this hinge is no longer defined to be rotating in any way, it's just stuck and attached, it will move. But this piece of the wing is going to stay in the same orientation relative to that hinge component. So this has a very different behavior because the hinge itself was attached in a different way. So be very careful about how you set these things up, but also notice that there are a variety of different combinations of attachment and behaviors that you can get out of these components.